and I are here today because we both want what? Great health, right? Yes. We have our, 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 our spouses, we have our children, we want to be around, right? To even have to see our grandchildren and be the best versions of ourselves. And that's what God wants from us also. Yeah. Right? We have a lot of work to do, a lot of people to help, but it's all about choice. You only have two ways to get from place to place. You have your vehicle and you have your body. So with your vehicle, here's the good news. If it breaks, if it crash, you can always have insurance and buy another one. Mm -hmm. Here's the danger with the body. When you have a heart attack and you have a stroke, you get cancer, the body is broken. You cannot borrow my body. I cannot borrow yours. You can borrow somebody else's car, but we have one vessel and we need to take care of it. For as long we are on earth, we want to be in the best health poss possible. So it's about treating, I see a lot of people, they take such immaculate care of their cars. Just like you, Jorge. You, you know, it's, it's, it's something you take pride in. And you will find the money to get the nice car and to take care of it and to maintain it. All we're asking people to do is take care of your body just like you take care of your car. When your car crash, you know, it doesn't work, you can call an Uber. When your body breaks, you cannot do that. You're stuck inside a body that was sick with disease. And guess what? That's what happened to me. I was stuck in a body full of disease. I was on nine medicines. Three months later, disease free. So it is very liberating and very exciting when you make a shift and you treat your body with even more respect than you, you, you treat your car because this is what we have for the rest of our life.